Well, great morning, everyone. Great morning from here in Quartzsite. I'm ruffle shuffling cards, and um, I'm going to use three Oracle decks here. Different, a little different than Tarot, and I want to pull some cards. And then we may look at Tarot as well. But I want to ask the question, Nikki Haley finally called out Trump and laid it on the table and said that he is calling her name and said he offered her 60,000 troops. And she says, I wasn't in office then. Okay, <laughs> it wasn't me. I wasn't there. He is in, you know, people listen. You know, I worry about my children. Uh, he's in cognitive decline. It's, you know. <laughs> so let's see what we have. First thing out, resilience. Okay. So when I see the resilience... There are some people, I'll just say it this way, batshit crazy, that will, you know, claim, oh, it, it wasn't a gaffe by him. He did it on purpose, um, you know, to, to try to uh, play, uh, what is it, three-way three uh, chess, okay, because he's so brilliant, okay? <laughs> Uh, the other thing we have, create, okay, creating the web, okay, <clears throat> so putting this together, creating a web, and relationship, now their relationship is on the outs, their loggerheads, <clears throat> okay. So it looks like there will be those that, of course, die hard. Um, you know, Trump has been sent by God. That that group <laughs> of the evangelicals that um, that are saying, "Oh yeah, he's just creating a web to catch her in." Okay, he's so smart, resilient. Okay, batshit crazy in here. Um, and it's just their relationship, okay? So there are those that will say that. Um, yeah, crazy. But let's get the tarot and see what it has to say. Now, I think that's just his, you know, most delusional cult MAGA people that are taken in by this thing that God sent Trump, and he is, you know, he is the orange messiah, spray tan messiah, yeah. So God sent the spray tan messiah in to save America. Oh, Lord have mercy. So let's see, is this Nikki Haley calling this out? Is this going to make any kind of change? You know what? I think I'm going to start with my Lenormand, my deck. My deck that I've created, the Lenormand, because I have put in at least 15 extra images that is not in the, the uh, typical Lenormand deck. So what we have overarching thing for all of this, the writing is on the wall. It's kind of like, you know, check it out. See for yourself what he's saying. He's, he's running against Obama. Okay. Um, he's, he's trying to birth or ploy yet again with Nikki Haley now, like he did with Obama. And, uh, you know, he's, he's, calling her instead of Pelosi and yeah so the writing is on the wall she's saying at the center of it it's about protection <clears throat> okay underneath of it she says you know look at what is happening 
you know, uh, and I think it's about the cognitive decline, etc., that's going on with him. Okay. Um, that's what's crossing it. She's talking about protection. And just look at the life path. The foundation of it. Where he's at. In the past, you know, she looked to him. And was kind of friendly with him. After all, she was in his cabinet for a time. What's going on now? She's talking to the community about what's going on with him above it. Yeah, that's her spreading the word underneath of it at the foundation. That's what's at the heart of it, okay? And underneath of it, this is the argument that she's putting out that, yeah, look, he's in cognitive decline. The challenge is the books, the law, um, okay? Are people going to look at the reality of things, okay? The outcome is, you know, this delusional thing with the um, extreme MAGA, you know, the evangelicals, the evil angel church that keeps pushing him as the orange messiah, literally. Spray tan messiah. So above it, we have the message. The foundation is about government, the strength of government and his, where he's at. And underneath of it all, all the flowery drama that he's putting out there. Okay. Uh, with some people, it's going to cause some fireworks. Okay. It's going to cause some shakeup with some people. When she says, look at the writing on the wall, that's what I get with this. The writing on the wall is he is cognitively impaired. Now, I've said this for a long time that he has dementia. Okay, I've said this a few years ago. He has dementia. Okay. <clears throat> but let's get the regular tarot. And see what we have with this. <clears throat> okay. Overarching above it all. Let's look and see what we have here. What can you tell us about this subject? It It's going to cause an eruption. Okay. An eruption. We know he's going to blow his top when she says he's mentally... Incompetent. <laughs> <clears throat> you know, he can attack them, but they can't attack him. So at the center of it all, this is strong word. She's coming out. She's coming out with sword in hand, slice and dice. Um, okay. And it's about you know, mentally, he is tied up. Now, he's going to, the other edge of the sword is he's going to try to tie her up, come back at her, because that's what he does. You come after me, I'm going to come after you, you know, try to end you, um, because, of course, she doesn't like what's going on with this, and, of course, he doesn't like it. How dare this, this nothing girl come at me like that? In the past, we've had some of these sleepless nights going on. A lot of mental realm here. That's all mental. Every single card so far has been about the mind. Okay? Talking about it. What's going on now? This is being juggled with some people. Above it, how his mind is working, how quick it is. And... uh the foundation is this new action of underneath of it all. Some judgment is going to come down with it. Okay. Eruption time. Okay. The foundation, her foundation, the <laughs> challenge, the challenge is going forward. 
How is this going to work out, this action? The outcome is the choices being made, the path being walked. Okay. Above it, we've got this toxic thing that people are chained to him toxically. Um, the foundation is, you know, this is an emotional thing for a number of people. And underneath of it all, the strength of what is being said. Um, the fish tales, the drama, what they're being fed. Okay. So I think that some people may be starting to look at him a little more deeply. But let's break this down. <clears throat> major arcana, what's majorly going on with this? Judgment about his toxicity, where he's going, the path he's walking, and the strength of it, okay? Looking at him, okay? There are those that are going to look more deeply, okay? This is causing an eruption among some of the MAGA crowd, okay? Um, it's being juggled now by some people. They're, they're starting to weigh this out now. Um, mentally, she's coming in with a strong point about he's being tied up cognitively not happy with what's being said there have been some sleepless nights now when it comes to him and his mental thing the way it's just you know he gets out there and he's just rambling there is no thread to anything it's like it's one thing and then something comes else into his mind and then he's off on that and then he's off on another thing. Yeah, not good. This is causing some no uh, overflowing emotions with some people and they're starting new action to look about going forward. Uh, really, is this the person we want at the helm? So it's saying that uh, only his more, most diehard will be totally uh, saying that he's resilient and no, and he's playing, uh, you know, three-level chess, and uh, yeah, he's setting a trap, etc. His most diehard magas will be saying that. Uh, but those that have any kind of rationality will be starting now to juggle and look at this more closely after Nikki Haley comes out herself and says, look, he's mentally impaired. He's in cognitive decline. Okay, he's got dementia. This is not just the um, difficulty of the trials. He has dementia and has for quite some time. They've been able to kind of cover it over for a while. But now it's coming to the point where he can't hide it any longer. And all he does, he doesn't really have good talking points out there of rational. That's why he won't debate. He can't debate. He doesn't have enough mental wherewithal to be able to carry a thread of conversation or a thread of um, ideology, etc. He just can't. He's, he's, you know, one thing and another thing and another thing. Okay. So I'm going to leave that here, and we'll see you online.